Hi guys, this is Jean here. I uh, hope you are all keeping well in these troubled times. Uh, you know I spent about two months in Ames Cameroon last summer and it was an incredible experience that I will never ever forget. Uh, I made friends for life, to be honest. Marco and the tutors were very friendly. I will never forget the grumpy Tonton Germa and the naughty Rockefeller. Uh, I'm sure Annette will never forget me, as I used to annoy her so much. Uh, I just want to say that I am absolutely glad that you are running the Three Minute Thesis competition again this year, and well done to whoever is organising it. Um, you know that nowadays public speaking is extremely important for scientists, uh, not like before, where uh, science was just restricted to the scientific community. And outside that community, people did not really know anything about scientific discoveries. <clears throat> now, this is the era of not only connecting science or mathematics to real world contexts, but also communicating and disseminating our finding to the public. Uh, everybody has the right to know what scientists are doing. Now, of course, there's a challenge and the challenge is the language we use in the scientific community. Um, we as scientists, especially mathematicians, we speak a totally different language that people outside the scientific community would not understand. So this is your challenge in this competition. You need to be able to break your science down so anyone can understand it, even your mother or father or anyone really. Public speaking is extremely important and powerful, guys, and most jobs nowadays require this skill. And don't forget, if you want to lead in anything, you must know how to communicate your ideas. Now, it's okay if you don't win in this competition, at least um, you had the courage to stand up and talk, and this is a great achievement. Now, all the best, guys. Uh, enjoy the event and stay safe. Peace.